Well, let me grab a little bit of Anastasia Beverly Hills eyeshadow primer. Hi, happy Sunday. You made it. We did review Tammy Tanuka's Sunset eyeshadow palette. By the way, I will link it up in here somewhere. This is basically going to be a part two and we are going to be doing this palm leaf eyeshadow palette. Sounded weird. We're going to be creating a look with this eyeshadow palette. That's gonna be better. <laughs> that middle shade. Mm -mm -mm. That is some nice duochrome on your eyes. Let me swatch the shades for you because I am really excited to see how they will be because I need to know what I'm working with today. Oh my God, you guys, I just swatched it. Wow. Do you see that? Tammy Tanuka. Mm. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Look at how stunning, look at that reflect. It is almost glass. Let me give you guys some close-ups of this because it deserves it. It really deserves it. I don't know about you, but that pink shade is definitely going on my eyeball today. We can finally start uh, applying the shades onto our eyes and I already prepped my eyes with Anastasia Beverly Hills eyeshadow primer because you know if you want to take your eye look to the next level use a damn eyeshadow base <laughs> if I'm not wearing any eyeshadow base I feel like after two hours my eyeshadow is completely gone. So um, applying eyeshadow base really can make my eye look last up to, well, definitely eight hours, depending on which eyeshadow base I use. And also the quality of the eyeshadow. I'm gonna take again my fluffy blending brush and I'm basically going to define the transition shade and I'm also going to try to kind of build up the color a little bit. I'm dipping into that green shade and it is such a nice shade. Like I love the way it looks, the color. Pack it on first with my blending brush and then I'm going to slightly start wiping and blending basically that into my brow bone. Again, blending oh so nicely. I'm not kidding, like I am dead seriously. I, I, the blendability is absolutely fine. No trouble whatsoever. I'm gonna take a different brush and I'm gonna take that brown shade and basically put it in the outer corner just to kind of trying to deepen up the shade a little bit. Yeah, that's definitely not a shade to build up, I feel like. So my mistake there, but can you? I don't think you can. Oh, just like slightly? No. Like I see a little bit of a difference. We just made it less green with that brown. Let me just try to pack it on a little bit more. Yeah, I think, yeah, it's not going to give you that dimension, which is for me fine. Because you can just take like... <laughs> Almost in every eyeshadow palette, there is a black shade. So if you want to deepen it up, you can just use that one. Or if you find with this, then it's also fine. I'm definitely popping on that pink shade on top of like my whole eyelid. But I want to use NYX Glitter Primer this time. Um, in the first part, I did like one eye with and one without, and you could definitely see the difference between the two eyes. So I want the vibrance on my eyes today, okay? I'm gonna take that lighter shade and put it on my inner corner. Mm, 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 mm. That is satonin. Satonin. Okay, let me dip into the gold and I will put that, well, maybe a little bit here and also a little bit there. That would complement the screen so bad. Well, not bad, but good. But you know what I'm you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> when I'm trying Tammy Tanuka's eyeshadows, I'm like, what do you have in store for me? Because this is amazing. Again, not sponsored, bought with my own money. Guys, Russian brands don't do PR, okay? They don't. They don't care. Russian business of makeup is not the same as like the American style. I'm going to take that pink shifter shade right now. Look at the glass! 
Oh, bitch. Mm. Oh my god. I hope camera can catch what I'm talking about. This is the real shit, okay? These are high quality shimmers, duochromes, whatever the hell you want to call them. It's so lightweight. It's not even chunky on my eyes. How did you make it? How? Like, how? There's still a lot of pigment on my finger, so I can just basically go on and on and on. And if I swipe it, <laughs> I can actually do my second eye with it, probably. What? I'm gonna make you buy all this stuff. I'm so sorry, but... <sighs> If you're an eyeshadow lover, or if you're collecting eyeshadows, this will be the thing. Like, I fucked up right there with my eyeshadow base because I did not apply it enough on this side. So this is what happens when you, like, don't, don't use eyeshadow base. Let me just wipe it away, and then we will do, like, a decent eyeshadow base application and also eyeshadow application. I apply my eyeshadow base with a brush, but I think that is where the mistake was. I needed to apply it with my fingers like I always do. Just freaking stick to the plan, Uli. Stick to the plan! Well, let me grab a little bit of Anastasia Beverly Hills eyeshadow primer. I cannot do Russian accents, guys. I don't know why it's, it's like that, but I can't. Good! Take two! If that's gonna be patchy again, I'm gonna lose my shit. See how nicely it blends now? Eyeshadow base application. NYX Glitter Primer makes everything shinier. Apply it on the inner corner for the dimension. Going from light to slightly darker shade. Oh my god. Bitch. I do love that duochrome though. <laughs> Let me do now my lower lashes. Here on my green side, of course, I will take that green and plop it right under. And on the other side, I will, of course, take that brown shade. Okay, let me finish off this look with a little bit of concealer under my eyes. I'm going to set it. I'm going to do my lashes and then I will come back. Don't go anywhere. Ladies and gentlemen, we're all done. The pink side is basically my favorite side. I do like the other side as well. It's a really natural, neutral eyeshadow look. I feel like both eyes are pretty much neutral. Like it's not over the top. It is really like this soft kind of look that you can also, you know, create when you're going to work or in an office or whatever. Do I need to tell you how good they are? I don't think so. That was it for today's video, guys. Thank you for joining and I will see you next week. Don't forget to subscribe if you don't want to lose me out there on the big YouTube web of YouTube content creators. Bye, guys.